Welcome to the Crypto Teacher. And guys, please like and subscribe. If you do like what you're listening to, please inform your friends and family. It is imperative that we get back to learning finances and understand how the world really works. <clears throat> now, guys, we're going to go over uh, Bitcoin first. Uh, Bitcoin right now is steady, as we know, going into the weekend. Based institutional investors come in. We have Bach on the 13th or 14th. So I'm going to do a video tomorrow about Bach and the halving. So that's a very important video tomorrow. You don't want to miss that. But guys, the most important news that I'm going to go over is the Treasury is going to be doing $3 trillion. Borrowing $3 trillion, guys. Now remember, guys, I did not know about this $3 trillion yesterday. I told you, in the media, they're talking about stock crash, stock crash, stock crash, the second stock crash. That's all you hear about is the stock's going down. If you look at earnings, you see that most of the NWO stocks, they actually went up. They didn't get hurt because we know what? What, what do we know? That 75 to 80% of stocks are owned by the top 10%. We know that they stole 11.5 trillion. Nobody talks about the 11.5 trillion that went off the stock market and whose hands it went into. Just remember that, guys, who owns the stock market? Regular average Joe is not buying stocks. The only reason why he has stocks is either in 401k or pensions. That's the only reason. The rest of the stocks are owned by the top 10%. So, guys, when we actually look at this $3 trillion, where is it going to go? It's going to go to stocks going to go to the bonds that they're going to be buying, these junk bonds they're going to be buying. And then also it's going to be going to cryptos, this, this new economy that is going to be built. We clearly see this in motion. Like I stated, we're going to start having regulation in a few months. You just going to all of a sudden see it pop up. We're going to see the uh, Bitcoin ETF this summer. But $3 trillion, guys, $3 trillion. You know how much money that is? Now, don't forget, when Obama went into office, it was $700 billion. So that is only, what, about 11 years ago? Now they're coming and they're going to be doing $3 trillion? That money is not going to be coming to you. Now, remember, they just did $2 trillion. The small businesses didn't get any of that money. What happened? It went to the corporations. And now, of course, they said they're going to be paying it back. But we know a lot of them are not paying that back. We know that 60 million people still haven't got the $1,200 that was supposed to be put out. And we know a lot of people are not going to get it because they're out the system. So where is that money going to go back into? The hands of them. They know that, okay, if we do $2 trillion, we can give away close to a trillion. But the rest of that, we get to keep for our uh, activities that we want to do. And if you go look at that bill, that money went everywhere. I mean, everywhere but to the people. So I did a video on where they took a lot of that money and went into new engineering and all that. We know that that money is not going there. That money is going to the, the New World Order objectives. That's where the money is going. So they put a whole lot of little things in the bill, and that's how they do bills. When, they, the, when the bills are supposed to be about the people, they put little things in there to, to, to get the money. To steal the money, guys. That's all this is about. So, guys, we have to make sure that we understand that the NWO has their objectives and how they pay for their objectives. And that's through bills. Keep passing bills. Keep passing laws. So, therefore, they can keep getting money from the people. And $3 trillion, guys, remember. Just remember this. That they said that they're going to be taking $3 trillion. I guarantee you this money is not going to the people. So, we're going to make sure that we keep track of this. I'm definitely going to be doing more videos and following the bill that they passed and doing the same thing I did with the two trillion. I went over all the little uh, activities that they put inside the bill that had nothing to do with getting this economy back on track. I think one of them was they were giving money to the JFK Museum or something. It's, it's crazy, but and it was like millions of dollars. That makes no sense. But uh, basically, going to uh, more Bitcoin news, we have Pantera Capital. The states that Bitcoin uh, basically is going to be going through the roof. So we know Pantera Capital was a part of buying, uh, well, putting in money as far as with Ripple when they first started. All of these, Pantera, when you see Pantera Capital, you see SBI, you see Andreessen. All of them were at the beginning of cryptos. So we know that this is the actual future. 
So we, just like I said, basically we just have to make sure that we are investing properly in the cryptos that we know that's going to make. And it's like I said, I'm going to start doing videos on different cryptos and you can decide once you finish doing your own research of whether you want to invest in those. Uh, but also uh, getting back to that uh, $3 trillion. Now, don't forget that stocks were going 19 times earnings. And, of course, stocks dropped. So they're probably about 12 or 13. So you're talking about $3 trillion. You're going to keep the stock market where it's at. Why are you going to keep the stock market where it's at? Because this is election year. They're not going to have the people in disarray when it comes to this election so guys everything will get back on track and the fact is that that's what this three trillion dollars is for is to keep this illusion going on like i stated once this uh election is over then reality will soon hit people because guys we don't hear anything about the china trade china trade is in the back burner we see that china is moving the economy is back to normal they not even worry about the c-word it's the United States. And then now you have this um, this uh, hornet, this killer hornet, all of a sudden. Where is it from? Asia. This Asian killer hornet all of a sudden appears in the United States. So, uh, but guys, don't don't take into the fear. You got to be bit like 23 times in order to die from it. So basically, it's just selling a lot of fear. But yes, basically, this hornet just has to come from Asia and uh, basically can kill all the bees. So... Guys, you have to understand the NWO objective. And uh, basically, that NWO objective is not in your favor. Now, with this $3 trillion, guys, we have to make sure that we are digging deep and, and researching these stocks. Because basically, like I stated, if you know the NWO, and I'm going to do a video on a few of them. I'm not going to do all of them because, of course, basically... You have to also do your research behind me, but the NWO stocks always make it out. So we just make sure that we are investing in these NWO stocks. You know, your Netflix, your Uber, your Lyft. So we just have to Amazon, Google, Verizon. These stocks will make it out of all this craziness that happens towards the end of the year because we will have a i'm not saying that we won't have a second stock market crash we're definitely going to have one but it's not going to be right now just like i stated everything is geared towards the masses they have to keep the masses asleep they're the only ones that believe in this c word to shut down the economy because of someone gets sick that makes no sense whatsoever but the fact is that the masses you can go on facebook Twitter, anywhere, Instagram, and people are telling each other, hey, no, we shouldn't open up the economy. Guys, you have to make sure that you're paying your bills for survival because when this is over, then what you're going to do? These small businesses will never get back on track of where they were at. So it makes no sense whatsoever to shut down the economy for this. We clearly see, uh, just like I stated, China, where it started, yeah, billions of people over there should have been a way more people infected, but it wasn't because this is all planned out, guys. Like I tell you, everything is a plan. So as long as you stick to the plan, especially financially, you're going to be straight. You might not make millions and millions of dollars, but you will be fine. You will be uh, financially set. So we just have to make sure that we are digging deep in these stocks, the cryptos, because they're definitely about to pump it. And the masses are going to be back out shopping like they normally do. So definitely do not be a part of the masses. Do not get distracted because we definitely will get back to normal. As you can see, all the states have a plan of opening back up this month. So everything will get back to normal, guys. And the fact is, is that do not get distracted with it. That's the, that's the biggest issue. But guys, that's all I have for you. Don't forget about the book, Crypto Teacher, and the NWO book. I want to thank those who purchased. Also, those who donated to the Cash App, Patreon. Also, uh, your cryptos, Coinbase, Bitru, Binance, your stocks, the banks, Cobalt, Chip Stocks, Gaming. They're going to make it through the storm. Everybody's sitting at home. Don't forget about those stocks. Also, the C word is still out there, the biotech stocks. Also, all these people are out of work. Don't forget about the weed stocks and the alcohol stocks. And y'all have a wonderful day.